Hi, Franco Cavallari coming to you from the gym in between sets. I want to talk to you a little bit about inflammation. I've been thinking a lot about some of the work we're doing in the lab and how it relates to some of the questions that come in. So I try to manage the questions in real time. And talking about inflammation while covering from injury. And this is a precarious concept or subject matter to discuss because, you know, we've got to consult with a physician who may know the particulars of your injury to be able to really accurately and safely manage an exercise program that is not going to cause more damage. But here's the general gist exercise helps mitigate prolonged inflammation. So if you're injured, you're injured joint tissue or soft tissue being muscle tissue, to be able to find ways to keep moving and exercising the body actually stimulates the body's natural mechanisms that help control inflammation, pain, and discomfort. Now, believe it or not, this includes even myocardial infarction or heart attacks where the myocardial or heart tissue itself, the heart muscle, is deprived of oxygen, blood and oxygen, which then causes sections of that muscle to become damaged, in fact, even die. Believe it or not, the sooner you can get back into exercise, this is full research, it's in the public journals, the sooner you get back into exercise, even in the case of these myocardial uh, issues, the faster that heart tissue can recover and the lower likelihood of expanded heart tissue. There's lower inflammation, improved a level of markers associated with damage and inflammation. And we see these same markers that we study in the lab for other diseases, but uh, it caused me to read these papers in, in the context of heart attack. So just making sure it's clear that if you are sedentary, especially as you age, your ability to manage the chemistry of inflammation declines. If you stay active, the body naturally activates anti-inflammatory processes to mitigate prolonged inflammation. Remember, inflammation is healthy. It's important. It's critical to the restoration and recovery process, whatever that may be in the context of your disease or injury. Okay, it's important, but prolonged inflammation that's not managed properly then interferes with the restorative process. And it's exercise, physical activity that helps bring it back in check so that the body recovers properly. It's the load that you put on your body that says to the body, hey man, this guy's active. He needs that muscle to stay fit. We better restore it real quick. You need that heart muscle because my gosh, he's on a treadmill and we're pushing the muscle. Don't shut down the tissue, keep it active. Let's fix it and restore it. That's how the body works. It's conscious. So make sure it stays alive by staying on an exercise program.